This is the Eco Atlantic 8.5 MW electric construction site. Watch this video to the ending to discover more because on today's video I'll be showing you the construction progress which is almost completed and how I was able to gain access into this construction site. The only way I could gain access into this construction site to show you guys this amazing project is by going in as a staff or going there to propose a deal. Actually, I didn't have those proper dressing construction people do wear those vests and co cool, and i didn't have a helmet so the best thing i could do was to walk in and propose a deal for them don't worry i have my things planned out and i was so amazed how it is watch out to the end of this video because you'll also be surprised how a video i tried to make just to show you the 8.5 megawatts construction turned out to be something else i actually went there to propose a deal and show them what i can do and luckily for me it's all played out well so do watch the video to the ending and listen closely to the conversation i had with them and how i was able to meet the general construction site manager and how i also met the engineer who is in charge of this echo atlantic as in general let's watch the video now Good afternoon. Good afternoon. So, um, i came to see for the project i'm a drone pilot at this point when i met the security officer i didn't know any word to say but what just came out of my mouth was i'm a drone pilot and i was lucky he actually directed me to the right place where i could meet some of the people who are in charge of the construction and luckily for me i decided to walk straight down and since i told him i was a drone pilot i had that in mind already and i also had my drone in my bag at the moment so it was even will i say this is a coincidence or it's just things working out fine anyways let's go back so i started walking and looking for the major entrance which he already directed me to and it kind of felt so dusty and rough because a lot of tractors and motors were working and moving and it was also noisy because construction sites are usually like that a lot of iron heating and a lot of things but now i'm very close to the gate and i will show you my conversation and how i was able to meet the real engineer and those who are in charge of this construction don't forget to like share and subscribe and also watch this video to discover how the conversation go see the second part <laughs> So let me hear you. Talk, I can hear you. Uh, America embassy. America embassy. Please, you guys should stand up. You have some. I'm 
Давай, Сычок. Эй, Сычок, вот. Эй, Сычок. Эй, мой брат, пайло, я пайло. Эй, ты пасу, я гэвэ, гэт, гэ, я дуа, ба, по, ду, гэ, so at this point the person who wanted to help me actually said the number of their drone pilots or the person who does the drone jobs for them is not reachable or rather switched off so at this moment i lost all hope thinking oh so i won't be able to get access into this vicinity and film this video as i was thinking that this security officer who's putting on blue was questioning me like where i was from and he was very very nice telling me oh that i might have gone through a lot of stress well, yeah, right in my mind i knew what i actually came for so he was so helping and also considerate and he actually told me that i should go and meet the two engineers that are at the front even though the other men asked me to go and stand outside this one was the one who encouraged me to go meet the engineers by myself and tell them what my plans are and this was how i went to meet them watched my conversation with the engineers when i went there So at this point, he took me into his car and decided to drive me to their main office and the rest was story. I hope you enjoyed today's video and wish me luck.